A story now about a couple of downtown hotspots that uh, are serving drinks virtually in hopes of helping their staffers and also giving back to the community. Our Taylor Alanis joins us live from the studio tonight uh, with how they use their tips to feed health care workers. Taylor. Joe, it's actually a really great plan. Taking donations, buying food from local restaurants, and giving those meals to the men and women on the front lines of this pandemic. To help businesses survive right now, Visit Corpus Christi launched a virtual happy hour where bartenders stir, shake, and pour cocktails over Facebook Live. Since they can't serve customers in person, they ask for donations as tips to help their staff pay bills or buy food for themselves. Well, when it was Casey Ortiz, Ortiz's turn to be behind the bar. She wanted to help more than her employees. Ortiz is the employee uh, manager at Cassidy's Irish Pub. She contacted friends over at House of Rock to see if they would be willing to meet halfway. Casey gave $450 with help from tips she received from Happy Hour, and House of Rock matched her $450 too. Staff making and delivering 30 to 40 pizzas to nurses at Christus Spawn Shoreline. You know, they're still going out there every day. I've seen videos and, you know, Facebook posts of people who had to send their kids to stay somewhere else because they're caring for these um, COVID people that are sick and they can't go home and risk giving it to their kids and things like that. So it's just, it's you know, it's, it's a small thing, but I, it, I hope it meant a lot to those people anyway. In about a week and a half, people have donated just over $1,500 through virtual happy hour. If you want to join in on the fun and help these bartenders, we will post a link to the page on our website at KIITV.com. And with these says, the virtual happy hour schedule is pretty full right now, but she hopes to hop on back soon and order from other struggling businesses, then donate that food to both healthcare workers and first responders. Joe.